Hello, investors. Welcome to the channel where I use technical analysis to find possible swing trades. Today, we're taking a look at American Tower Corp, ticker symbol AMT. This is a large cap REIT with a market cap just over $75 billion. It is a specialized REIT in that they own and lease cell towers to various cellular companies. Now, the good thing here is I do not see our world becoming less dependent on the internet and cellular connections. So as time goes on, I believe this REIT will continue to grow. And here we are on AMT's annual chart. You'll see it is well below all the major moving averages. In fact, we are at the 52 week low. And this presents a excellent buy-in opportunity. Of course, you wanna to try to buy it at the low, whether that works or not is always a roll of the dice, but if you were to take a chance, it does seem like this is a good place to begin taking a position, at least if you were interested. And we have the RSI, which is oversold, although it does look like it is going lower. We have both stochastics oversold, and they also look like they're going lower. We have the volume chart, which shows a definite increase in volume lately, but most of it is red, as you can imagine. Now the volume is decreasing. It has not yet been replaced with buying pressure, so you could have some more red days coming, and the MACD looks like it's actually going sideways, although it does appear to have formed a trough. We'll see where that goes. So based on these technicals, it does look like AMT is set to continue falling for at least a bit more. And if we switch over to the fundamentals, you'll see that it has very low short interest at 1.11%. High institutional ownership at just over 90%. These are great indicators that smart money likes AMT. The debt to equity ratio shows it has more debt than 93% of other companies in the specialized REITs industry, which is not something particularly I'd like to see, but it is what it is here. We know that they need to take on debt to buy more land and equipment to create the cell towers. So I would like to see the debt come down in the future. The PE ratio is also high, greater than 89% of other companies in the industry. A PE of 78 is high in any industry. So again, I'd like to see that come down a bit further. Now that is a function of their earnings. So if their earnings go up, then of course the PE will proportionately go down. And we look over here, gross margin, gross margin of 70% is excellent. And that is uh, truly showing some profit here. And that beats out 61% of other companies in their industry. An operating margin of 22.84% is also excellent. And that is above average for the industry. It beats out 64% of other companies in the specialized rate industry. And I'll point out the net profit margin here, just over 8%. That is also quite good, particularly for a REIT. So if we move down to the return on equity, return on equity is almost 16%, which is excellent. And that beats out 79% of other specialized REITs. Now the growth rate is low for the industry. Again, there's only so many cell towers you need in a certain area. So they have to continually expand to new and unpopulated areas with cell towers. And that's not always the most cost efficient thing to do until people begin living there and using them. So it is understandable that the growth rate is a bit below average. And dividend yield is just over 4% at the current share price, which is excellent. And the, the payout ratio here is, it reads as almost 300%, but we know that's simply accounting tricks that they used to skew that number. They're not paying out triple their income every year in dividends. So all things considered, this could be a good time to buy in to American Tower, but please let me know what you think in the comments below. And remember that none of this is financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor. I make these videos for education, information, and discussion. But if you get something out of it, 
I would appreciate it if you'd hit the like button and subscribe to help out the channel. If you like this content, please hit the bell notification to be alerted when new videos post. And if you'd like me to take a look at a particular company using the indicators I present here, just mention that in the comments and I'll try to get to it as soon as I can. That's all for today. Thanks for watching and good luck with all your investments.